Good late morning, everybody. Movie Fan 2002 here, and as you all know, this weekend's going to be D23. What is D23, you may ask? It's a Disney Expo convention that happens every year around September, or at least whenever. Or at least it's like in either in August or September. And this, and this year, I just thought I might as well give you like some predictions that I'm hoping that they're going to bring out for this weekend. Now, obviously, these are just predictions, so of course, I won't be correct about all of them. Anyways, without further ado... Here they are. Anyways, first off, I'm hoping for to see at D23 is the Fantastic Four cast for the upcoming MCU Fantastic Four film they'll be having in Phase 6. And I'm really excited. Fingers crossed if they bring back John Krasinski to play, to reprise his role as Mr. Fantastic from Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness, because I thought he was great in that movie. Even though he was only short-lived, I thought it was he still did an excellent job with his performance. Yeah. Really excellent job, in my opinion. So, yeah. I don't know who else they're going to get um, for the rest of the Fantastic Four, so that's why I'm hoping on that. Hope we're get and, and, and I hope for the directors, I, fingers crossed, please bring back Joe and Anthony Russo. I really want the Russo brothers to come back for another MCU movie, in my opinion. I, I just really miss those guys. They did an awesome job with the Winter Soldier, Civil War, and especially Infinity War and Endgame. Alright. Next thing I'm hoping to see at... Uh, at Disney at D23 is the Guardians of the Galaxy Holiday Special trailer. Yeah, I'm hoping that they release this trailer for the Guardians of the Galaxy Holiday Special as well as the upcoming Halloween MCU special, which is the werewolf one. Yeah. But I'm more excited for the Guardians of the Galaxy Holiday Special. Yeah. That is definitely something I'm definitely going to be watching a lot in December. That and also rewatching Hawkeye for. Because they're both like in Christmas theme and all that stuff. Yeah. I'm just really excited to see how that goes. And it's nice, at least we'll be getting something with the Guardians, at least before, uh, before Thor Love, no, not Thor Love and Thunder, before Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3 comes out last year. I mentioned Thor Love and Thunder because, well, they were in Thor Love and Thunder for a little bit. Another thing that I'm look, looking forward to seeing is that, I fingers crossed we get the title for the fourth MCU Spider-Man film. I, I do not know what it's going to be at the moment, but we'll have to wait and see. One thing, Although, one thing is for certain, I'm not so sure that film's going to be as good as last year's No Way Home, because No Way Home was amazing. I mean... Another thing I am hoping for, and I swear, and I hope this does happen, is that we do get um, an announcement of when, of what Disney's next hand-drawn animated film is going to be. Yeah, I know that they haven't announced anything about it, but I'm hoping that for like one of their upcoming films, it will be in hand-drawn again, because... Let's be honest, I really miss hand drawing and I hope they do bring it back. Besides, especially with that whole special on Disney Plus with Eric Goldberg, I feel like it, you have to bring back hand drawn animation very soon. Because I really do miss the classic hand drawn style. As much as I do love Disney's films re <laughs> Disney's recent films, especially in Kanto, I really hope they do bring back the hand drawn animation. Another thing that I that I hope is announced at uh, at um D D G three is I hope that we get an announcement of when Disney is planning on releasing the unaltered theatrical versions of the original Star Wars trilogy. And when I mean the unaltered versions, I, yes, I mean the original theatrical versions that released in theaters in 1977, 1980, and 1983. They really need to be, be released, either on DVD, Blu-ray, or Disney+, Plus, because they definitely deserve it. At least in the HD quality, so we can at least watch the film. I mean, if Steven Spielberg can at least restore E.T. to its original version after the criticisms of its 20th anniversary release, then then I think we can do. Then I think Disney can do the same thing with this one. Besides, George Lucas isn't in charge of Lucasfilm anymore, so go ahead and do it. Do it. Anyways, another announcement I hope we get is the. Re uh, the official release date of Owl House Season 3, of when that's going to be coming, as well as possibly a teaser trailer for it, because I really want to want to see like what they have in store for the upcoming third and final season of, well, quote-unquote, final season of uh, of Dana Terrace's Owl, uh, Owl Show. <laughs> Although, it's only going to be three 44-minute specials, but I'm still excited to see how they end it. It's pretty much going to be um, the Owl House version of Weird Mageddon. Another th announcement that I hope, although it's not really an announcement, I'm hoping that it's the, it's the, 
they released a trailer for Disenchanted, the sequel to Enchanted that will be coming out on Disney Plus um, this week <laughs> in November, around the same time as Disney's Strange World. Anyways, another one I'm excited for is the is an official trailer for Avatar The Way of Water. That, this one is most likely going to happen. They're going to release an official trailer for the Avatar The Way of Water trailer. Hope we do get that. Then also, I hope we do get like the official trip, official screenshot, tr the official actual trailer of uh, of the Mandalorian season three, because I'm just looking forward to that. That and. The last thing I hope I want to see at um, the Dis at Disney G two three is is an announcement of either a Finding Nemo series or a Toy Story series. So, cause some because we have a Monsters Inc show and a car car series which is starting tomorrow on Disney Plus. I feel like we should do the same thing for a Disney Plus series for one of the two Pixar franchises that I mentioned. All right, there we go. That's all the announcements that. That's all the announcements for um, D23 that, that, I'm, that I'm hoping that will happen. Huh. Feel free to share yours down in the comments. And I'm glad I was able to bring this out before D23 comes. Anyways, see. Anyways, I'll see. Anyways have a good day and see you in the next one.